interesting idea. The idea, as you say, Jason, is to rely on modern technology to go after a long-time problem, and that is school bus runners. Every school bus driver knows the fear of dropping kids at their stops only to see vehicles speed by despite lights blinking and safety arms out. Wiley Lopez drives a bus in Delaware County. A lot of people just would rather try to beat the stop sign than to stop for these kids. And as a driver, how's that make you feel? I hate it, you know, because it could be my child, your child. But if there's no cop around to chase the violator and slap them with a ticket, it can happen again and again. It's why Chichester schools, along with Southeast Delco and the Norristown area districts, are turning to Bus Patrol, a Virginia-based company that's installing cameras on school buses to catch bus runners and send them a $300 ticket. Bus Patrol CEO says, as shown in this video, provided by the company, it's it's done with artificial intelligence technology known as AVA. She's able to monitor up to eight lanes of traffic and a variety of weather conditions and lighting conditions. And then we build evidence packages, which ultimately get put in front of law enforcement. The packages include video of the violator. Police decide if the law has been broken and bus patrol sends out the ticket to the registered vehicle owner. Anything that's going to make the children safer getting on and off the bus is a great thing. I mean, unfortunately, there's been too many sad occurrences that have happened throughout the nation. In 2017, Fox 29 documented that danger on a stretch of roadway in South Jersey where motorists repeatedly raced by stopped buses. Bus Patrol, which says it's working with 20 school districts across Pennsylvania, including five in the Philadelphia region, covers the cost of outfitting the buses and makes its money by taking a cut of the fine. They cost the school districts absolutely nothing. 100% of the cost to fund these programs is put squarely on the backs of those who break the law. Chichester plans to begin catching violators in early 2023. Even motorists think it's a good idea. That is very unsafe for you to do that with children being offloaded or unloaded on buses. They should be ticketed. This is not a criminal violation. It is civil. Motorists must pay the $300 fine. If they didn't think they did this, they'll be able to, be able to go online and see their car violating the law. Live in Upper Chichester, Jeff Cole, Fox 29 News. All right, Jeff, thank you.